we have had handicaps in so far as having a budget that has a mismatch in terms of revenue and expenditure. And that has been necessitating many supplementary budgets, many of which scale down the expenditure because of unrealized revenue, Madam Speaker. Madam Speaker, we are very buoyant this time, and we are very optimistic that the Kenya Revenue Authority, with the kind of leadership that is in that organization, and also in anticipation of having a substantive CG, Madam Speaker, we know for sure the kind of reforms in KRA, both administratively and in terms of policy, will enhance revenue collection, Madam Speaker, for us to be able to bridge that gap. Madam Speaker, also, I wish to say something about ANA, because it's one of the revenue streams that we have as a nation. Madam Speaker, I believe as the Budget and Appropriations Committee that there is still a lot of room for us to raise enough ANA, and especially by optimizing on the institutions, Madam Speaker, of government, and especially that which have revenue streams. We believe there is a lot of room for improvement that majority of the organizations of the, of the MDAs that are running from the exchequer, some of them could actually very ably run through the ANA. And therefore, Madam Speaker, we are very optimistic on that aid. Madam Speaker, I wish